Welcome to Digital Electronics Experiment Lecture Series. Today, I will be going to show you 3-bit synchronous up-down counter using multi-sim software. The video based on theory portion of 3-bit synchronous up-down counter is already added in Digital Electronics playlist. So here we implement the example of that video. For that, we need T flip flop. So go to Miss Digital, then go to TTL. And here we get T flip flop. After that, we need AND get, OR get, and NOT get. To copy the component, first select the component and then press Ctrl plus C and Ctrl plus V. Now, to apply the frequency at input side, we need a function generator. So here we get function generator. To observe the output, we need oscilloscope. So here we get four channel oscilloscope. Here we connect function generator's OVT terminal at a flip flop input and common terminal with ground. For ground, go to source, then go to power source. And here we get ground. To apply the digital constant at input T, we need a digital constant. For that, go to source, then go to digital source. And here we get interactive digital constant. Let's connect this all component. So now we connect oscilloscope edge and R at input M, D channel at output Q2, D channel at output Q1 and D channel at output Q0. Here we apply digital 1 to input T. Now we apply 4000 Hz frequency in square wave form at input clock and 250 Hz frequency in square wave form at input M. So now or all the setup of 3 bit synchronous up down counter is completed. So let's simulate the circuit. For simulation, click on run and double click on oscilloscope. Here, first we need to set this waveform in oscilloscope screen so we get clear idea about the output. So here we can see that the first waveform is input M, the second waveform is output Q2, the third waveform is output Q1, and the fourth waveform is output Q2. When M equal to 0 at a time, we get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 0. So here we can say that when m equal to 0 at a time, the synchronous counter acts as a synchronous up counter. When m equal to 1 at a time, we get 1, 0, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. That means here we can say that when m equal to 1 at a time, the synchronous counter act as in synchronous down counter. I hope you get clarification about 3-bit synchronous up down counter.
Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any query regarding this video, then write on comment box. I'll be definitely try to solve your queries.